When I first met Renan, I saw him as like a typical young climber coming into the scene. Kind of innocent and just venturing out. It was clear that he was dedicated. Clearly he had a drive to live kind of an unconventional lifestyle. After college, he basically tossed all his belongings and hit the road to be a climber and an artist. You know, pretty recently, I saw his art for the first time, and then it all came together. I mean, this art just grabbed me. Renan is this ascetic. He's this very quiet, contemplative artist, and his two forms of expression that I know about are with a brush and a pen or on the rock. Years ago, I saw this clip of him free soloing lightning bolt cracks on site, I think. You see him do that stuff and he looks out there. He looks like something's, you know, something's lit a fire under him. Renan was really pushing beyond being just a rock climber. He started to attempt speed ascents and first ascents in Pakistan, on the Trango Tower, on the Fitzroy Range in Patagonia, uh, on the Tooth Traverse in Alaska. His vision for what he wanted to be as a climber was really starting to expand. The soul of climbing was there in Renan. This kid was really sharp, had spent some time in Nepal, spoke Nepali, really even keeled, was an artist. He had the right demeanor and personality to do a heavy expedition. Shark's fin on Marrow Central. It's the headwaters of the Ganges River, one of the most sacred rivers on Earth. What's up, Renan? Oh, this is the source, the origin of the Ganges River, where it comes out of the glacier just behind me. The thing that gives it the name, the shark's fin, is this 1,500-foot blade of this beautiful, flawless granite, way up high, higher than Denali, you know, 20,000 feet. This is the, you know, the test of the, the master climber. We're a team, and we all will pull together and we'll all help each other out. And that's what makes it good. We've checked on our equipment. We know our, our gear's good, and now we just have to go do it. Definitely happy to be up here and uh, take part in Conrad's 20-year dream and 10 years of Jimmy and Conrad climbing together and yeah, feel part of the team.